Hello, welcome to Fish Gaming, and uh, my name is Fish, and welcome. <laughs> I guess I think I already said welcome, I guess. Um, what can I say about this game? It's Dragon Ball Z, obviously, and it's called Battle of Z. It's the newest addition to uh, history collection, or lineup, if you so will. I kind of put it between Raging Blast and Tenkaichi. I mm, think I said that right, like it's coming from around here. It's where Raging Blast is more cinematic and well, take I can't some training really in while I search the area. <laughs> but I know how it plays. And I have to say, this is probably one of my favorite Dragon Ball Z games of, that I've played yet. And it's not the fact that there's no transformations in the game or that the little bit of a sloppier combat great. system when they're getting up and they're <laughs> knocked down and you can't hurt them for some reason. I don't understand. So much, but not working. Okay. Right off the bat, I'll do an 8 out of 10. I love it. I still love it. I still haven't even beaten it yet to this point. Um, what can I say? This beginning episode is just like a tutorial where you learn to fly, you learn to fight, um, you learn to lock on, you learn to block. All that stuff that you, I didn't even know. So, you'll see from this episode up until probably the last episode I'll be uploading of the series that my gameplay is a lot better, kind of a lot better than I was going to first start. Because once you start understanding the mechanics and how to fight, it's a lot easier. But other than that, you know, it's pretty good. There's missions like this that you'll, you'll understand that kind of are irritating. And that right there was a failure to lock on. Like, see, it would be funny at that last knockdown. It just feels so great. I really feel like you feel that connection when you hit, which is nice to have. That's I felt that, that in uh, the last... Wow, no, I think it was I'm the last really Dragon Ball Z game I played. I can't Better remember what it was. It just wasn't that great. Double teaming, that was probably one of my favorite things about this game. It really makes teamwork work, because you can see there's an energy bar above the screen. And as you synchronize your teammates, you can do that punching fit combo kind of thing with right, there. With it. two or more Finally, people, you can do it in the air, you can do it on the ground. I don't know if you can do it with specific abilities, like say, Kamehameha and Gallic Gun together to create a double force beam. I don't know if that's going to work, but the combo works very well. With it. And so this is the ending of my thing, so... I hope you enjoyed it. It's nothing too special. It's just me playing my game, and I'm gonna get better with this commentary thing as time goes on. Because I don't know really know what to say to you. I keep you entertained, so I'm just trying to do a little bit of gameplay and a little bit of talking. Goodbye.